Hi, this is Cecilia from Tarot by Cecilia, and today is Thursday, October 28th, 2021. The tarot card for today is the Eight of Cups from the Pocket of Peers Tarot by artist Jamie Sawyer. But that cat looks an awful lot like my cat, and she does love to spend time on top of my head, usually biting my scalp and chewing on my hair. Anyway, you know, normally when I would see this card, I, I, it, it almost seems sad sometimes, but you know what? It's not. In this particular instance, it is not. I had taken a look at the next couple of cards that are coming up, and they're really showing that it's time, okay? In other words, you can't get a handle on where you need to be going and what you need to be doing without turning your back on a few things. And this is associated with uh, disappointment and abandonment. And you know, they kind of go hand in hand, don't they? Because when you become disappointed in something, you tend to move on. And there's so much more that's out there waiting for you. So that's really not a bad thing. And often, more often than not, it's more a matter of timing. It doesn't mean that what you are leaving behind is not good for you. It's more a matter of, you know, something may have been really good while it lasted, but it has served its purpose, okay? Making it time to move on and go explore some new territory. And there's nothing wrong with that, okay? But I think we as humans sometimes, you know, feel a little sadness with these things. So I honestly feel that this is a good move on your part. You know, whatever, when you think about it, everyone, right? How much have we all been through? And it's, it's time. It's time to move in new directions. And there's a lot of that coming up over the next few months. So don't think that whatever, you know, is happening right this moment is, you know, where you're aiming your your goals all right and we're going to be talking about them as well as your hopes and dreams now today we have the moon in leo well that's good for giving you a lot of courage it's also a very social moon and um it can lead to excess so just be careful because we do also have today that venus sextile jupiter which is one of i think we only had three major aspects this week but if monday and tuesday were kind of crappy for you you'll like today you know maybe even yesterday much better just do be careful not to go overboard with things all right because it's kind of lining up that way that the possibilities are there that you may you know do things to excess in the wee hours of the morning before the moon makes its move into Leo, it's going to square Mars, which is currently out of sorts being in Libra for a few more days until we get to the 30th. Now, you know, here's the thing. It just kind of, you know, hopefully you don't have to deal with this because the moon transits are not as long lasting but this one can make you a little bit short tempered so just be careful with that okay I, I think the big deal of today really is the venus sextile jupiter now there will also be um later in the evening in opposition between the moon and saturn now this is not a a tremendous influence on your day but it can affect you especially if you're prone to being sad all right in the kind of, you know, as a reflection of this card a little bit as well, all right? You have uh, the moon in a social sign. You have Saturn in a social sign. And yet the opposition that's there may be creating feelings within you that have you feeling hmm, depressed maybe a little bit. It's a short-term thing. It's not something that's long-term. So if you even remotely feel it for a moment just tell yourself this will pass and tomorrow is another day it just kind of is like maybe your evening may be better spent alone and there's nothing wrong with that you know so just keep in mind that i feel like you're on the verge of something here 
with this eight of cups okay so it's not a bad thing you know if you let's say you're you're just ready you know getting ready for new things and understanding the place that certain things have had on your journey and you know they've brought you to this point so right over these next few months maybe even three to six you'll have many changes coming your way and of course you can hear more about that on my subscription platforms and you know follow me there to find out what is actually coming up in the next six months or so so i want to thank you all very much for being here i'll see you here again tomorrow and as always have a great day